Okay, so for this experiment, we're going to create a basin. We need to take a sheet of cardboard, fold the edges up to about an inch and a half high, and then tape them off. We'll cover that over with a uh, black plastic tablecloth. And then we're going to fill it with uh, water from a water pitcher. We want the water to be about three quarters of an inch deep. So uh, now we're just taping off our can. We're going to uh, take a uh, break off blade knife and put some protective gloves on. And uh, we'll trim the uh, area around where we've taped. And that'll create a flap that we can pull up and it'll allow the warm air from the candle to escape. Okay, so we've got our friend Susie here and uh, she wants to get to the other side, as we said, uh, to meet Billy, Tommy, and Joey. They're going to have a little party, hang out. And so they're on this side. They're like, yay, let's do this. This is going to be awesome. So they're all hanging out over there with our little ping pong ball faces. And uh, they're like, Susie, come on, hang out, let's do something. We're going to go see a movie. We're going to a party. And so Susie's like, and they, they tend not, they tend not to, to stay up upright very well. Um, they, have a lot of, they have a lot of problems with that. Uh, so <laughs> especially Tommy. So Tommy's going to stay upside down over there. Susie's over here, and she's like, oh, I wish I could hang out with my friends. Ah. And so she's, she's wanting to go over and, and hang out with them, but she doesn't want to get in the water, and uh, she needs to find a way to get, to get across the water to hang out with her friends. So uh, she ends up thinking about like all of the things that she has, and she has a, a candle, and she has a tea candle, and she has a can. Uh, this is just a standard uh, soda can. And so she's like, ah, I have a candle, and I have a can. So she modified the can, and the can's got some, the can's taken on some water. Um, that's okay though. Uh, so she modified the can, and she wants to uh, use the can to get across the water in a really quick way. So she made this thermal sail, cut it out, and um, she's going to put the, uh, she's going to put the candle inside the can, and then she's going to see if she can use it to get across the pond and to hang out with Timmy, Jommy, Tommy, and, and, and Joey. All right, so she's going to light the candle to uh, re begin releasing some of that uh, potential chemical energy and turning it into kinetic energy. And uh, that kinetic energy is coming out in the form of heat. And so that heat is, is basically ex is causing the air around the candle to expand. And so she is going to get in the, uh, in the device, in the little... Uh, can here and see if she can get it to if she see if the candle has enough power to pull her across the lake and it looks like it does there it goes so what's happening is cool air is rushing in through the, the mouth of the can it's being heated by the candle it's expanding it's pushing on this thermal sail this the flap here and it's rising out of the back and that's causing the uh, that's causing the, the can to move forward and move across the, uh, the little pond here. And that's allowing our friend Susie to meet up with Timmy, jo Tommy, and Joey. Hey guys! <laughs> They're like, hey! So her boat can go about its way and uh, they, can have their, they can have their party, they can go to the movie or, uh, or whatever they want to do.